and we have made it to the only festival in the game, Lean Square in 1000 AD. Now, I did go in here, and I uh, got a few more um, silver points by, by betting on the race. That's my favorite way to get battle points. Uh, so I am now up to 67, which should be more than enough. Uh, no... No, I want to keep as many of those as I can. In fact, if you had something that would go the other way where I could buy silver points, that'd be awesome. We need to go in here. Yes, 67 silver points. The Tent of Horrors. This is where we need to go, though. What's up? Are you... Yeah, Norstein Mechner's Lab. This is definitely where we need to be. We need a Vash clone. Yes. Normally, I'd never do this, but today I'll make an exception. Challenge me, and I'll give you a clone. The longer you stay in the game, the lower my price will be. Let's take the challenge. Mimic what you see. Left arm, right arm, laugh, surprise. Left arm, right arm, laugh, surprise. Okay, I think I got it. Left arm. Start when you hear a signal. And action. Laugh. Surprise! Laugh! I don't know if I know which one's left or right. Surprise! Surprise! More surprise! I don't know what is surprising. Okay, sweet. I got left and right down. Laugh! Right arm! Laugh. Another laugh. What's so funny? I'll take 5,000 G. Okay. That was it? Wow, that's longer than I usually last. Uh, that uh, is enough, though, for us to get uh, the clone. 5,000 G is not nearly as much as I was expecting. I thought I remember it being a lot more so. Which one is Vash's house? It's not this one. Vash's house. Let's go inside and find ourselves the clone. So, what is up, Kitty? How are you doing, Kitty? There was only the one Kitty, though. It's very lonely, Kitty. What's what? What's up, Mom? Oh, hello. Is Vash okay? Uh, he's okay. Fine, actually. I hope he's behaving. Tell him to be good, all right? Listen. Um. Yes, dear. Just borrow this doll, okay? Go right ahead, dear. And we got the clone! Can I have the Poyozo doll, too? Oh, we can close the, the shades, of course. Can we sleep in the bed? <gasps> we could! Mom, you wanna join in? I, I don't think she joined in. Well, she's still tired from what happened in there, so we're just going to move on and I'll... Uh, well, I believe we actually need to go back uh, to 2300 AD. I might as well keep that in. I feel like I've been cutting too much this session between all the uh, all the different items that we need to pick up. So I'll, c I'll keep in a little bit of the travel time here. It's not too much, um, but we do need to go back to Keeper's Dome. And now that we have, well, we have the clone with us, the clone, we can pass right by the freaking black omen. Nothing scares me. That's probably why they call it an omen. Can I land there? Thank you. That is Protodome. That is not the one that I need to go into at all. What is my problem? Ugh. Went, didn't go far enough over to the east yet. Over to the right, over to the east, however you want to phrase it. This way. We need to go more this way, don't we? That's where we did. Damn it, am I lost? I might be lost. No, I swore. Maybe it's down here. Ah, uh, yes, it is down here by the black omen. The black omen scared me. I didn't want to go near it. <laughs> but this is where we need to go. Back to Keeper's Dome. In here. Uh, the domes, they all look alike. What are you saying? Here we need to go back and talk to Belthazar. I got it. 
Yes, the pen and trimmers. Can't you just open the door? We've done this a few times. It no longer bears any significance that we open the door. We've been there. We've done that. We've moved on. Well, we haven't moved on. You won't let us game. On Death Peak, you always find the power of the deceased must be important to the space time community. We must have a clone identical to that person. Only then can a crowd trigger or work its magic. Enough. The time has come for you to attempt Death Peak. It's the only chance you have of reviving your friend. The last program I've implanted in this creature's memory banks will help you up the mountain. Stand back! Wait, so the news are robots? <sighs> oh, yo, Zoda! Wait, kind of. Not really, it's blue though. Executing program! It's blue, but it casts. Lightning. Executing program? So, there's multiple ones of these? Nice. You keep executing that program all you want. So, there's three of them. Where'd they go? The three entities you saw will help you climb Death Peak. This ends my message. Now I must ask you for a favor. This creature has executed its program. Please let him sleep. The switch is on his stomach. Yes. We let him sleep. He may sleep now. Godspeed. New. Freaking Greek letter. What was new? New was some math thing. I remember new meaning something. It was it was up there in, in math, but new definitely meant something. But we are done with the Keeper's Dome for now, and we need to save before we go up Death Peak. Almost forgot we need to bring Kyra back in for this. Now we are ready to take on Death Peak! Peak, even though it's got the word death right in the freaking name, and it kind of scares me. But we've already taken on Mount Woe, so how much harder can death be than Woe? Surely it's not that much diff more difficult. What's up, dude? Walk when the wind dies and hide behind trees when it blows? What? what how'd you turn into a tree? <laughs> that makes no sense. No sense at all. Oh, we didn't make it in time to the next tree. Yeah, typically you're going to be blown off the first time. Uh, so, no harm, no foul there. We can keep going through Death Peak. It shouldn't be too difficult now that there is a tree right there. That's apparently what we need in order to get up here. Uh, so the strategy here is uh, to run uh, until you get to the tree and then just walk when the wind blows. That way you don't run past it. See, that's me trying to run there. You, you might run past the tree. And that's not what you want to do. Uh, you don't have to be all that close to it, uh, just as long as you're behind the tree, really. It should be fine. So now let us move on, and we've made it to the next screen, and that's pretty much it for the uh, the harsh winds. Uh, but we do have new enemies here. We have upgraded Eggers. We have Crackers. You guys don't look like Crackers at all. That is a lot of damage that she just did. What is Kyra doing? What do I have on her? Oh, that's right, I have the Defender! I think I'm gonna have to check her equipment, I think. What is she doing? Damn, critical hit! Still not enough for the victory. But Luke's critical hit definitely should be enough for the victory. Down it goes. We get 1,134 experience points, 24 tech points, and 900 gold. Oh, um, right. I remembered uh, that I forgot to, to go over the dual text that we got before. So uh, just real fast, let's bring Jojo in so I can look at the dual text uh, that we got from actually defeating Speccio. Sorry that it took me so long to remember that. Uh, but there were definitely dual texts that we got with this group that I want to look at uh, that we never got. Uh, let's see. Ice water. No. No. Glacier. No. Uh, double cure. No. 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 Did Luke learn? Luke still hasn't learned any. What did you learn? I swear they learned something. I already had Slurp Kiss and Bubble Hit, so what was learned in terms of dual text? I just don't understand. 
I swore there were dual texts that were learned, but they just won't show up there. Should have looked when uh, when <laughs> the fight was over the first time. That probably would have been a good idea. So let's bring Kyra back in. Uh, they are the. These are pretty much the people that still need to get uh, the texts. Uh, let's take a look at what they do need to get. Uh, just while we're here, real fast, because texts are important, and we we still have people that need to learn them. Uh, we have Frog Squash still on the way, Flare on the way, and Dark Bomb on the way. That's going to be the closest one to being learned. Ugh. We got some good spells on the way, let me tell you that. Uh, but in here we get a magic ring. I believe that is our second one. Same thing. Uh, magic plus six. Let's go down here and take on more crackers. I hate saltines. You will die. I did finally figure out what was going on with Kyra. She's got the safe helm on and that that's how she reduces uh, physical defenses by looking like she's uh, defending all the time. So that's what that does. I need to climb up here and head over to the east onto the next screen. And here we find... Oh, they had a hidden enemy. We find three crackers and a ghost with a scythe. A macabre. Uh, let's go ahead and cast... Uh, let's go with uh, ice too on everybody. Why not ice? Why not ice? It makes all the snow disappear. Because I cast more ice, I don't understand. That's enough of the victory all around. Who kicks ass sometimes? We have 1,561 experience points and 32 tech points. 1,400 gold and an ether. And nobody's still... Yeah, no tech, dual techs or anything like that. Uh, we'll get more of those later. What do you want me to say? Oh! Straight into a save point. I will use it. Now that we have rested and saved, we can go up here and get ourselves a wall ring. Wall ring. It's anything like some of the other games. That should be awesome. Uh, what do you want? Uh, you're on increase HP. What does this wall ring do? Magic defense plus 10. That is very valuable, but I'm not going to be using it right now. Uh, not as valuable as I was hoping, though. Magic defense plus 10 is not exactly what I was looking for. I see that shiny over there. You can't hide that from me. It doesn't look like I can get up on that side yet. So we're going to have to settle to go up this side just a bit. And take on more macabre enemies. With those guys out of the way, we are free to move on into the cave. And here we find... Is, is that Lavos? Really, game? You're just gonna give me Lavos? Like, oh, he's kind of small, actually. Is it, wait, boss? It is boss time. What the hell? We're up against a Lavos spawn. Uh, now, the trick to this guy is to always attack the mouth. Do not go for uh, the shell. The shell will cause a counterattack just like that one that you saw just there. So uh, hopefully I can stay away from attacking that. And by hopefully I mean hopefully I don't misclick and actually hit the shell. Uh, we, we're going to go for red pin and uh, just a regular attack from Luke because Luke doesn't have any text that doesn't hit everybody. He doesn't have any single target text yet. Really? You're going to use the flame ability on Kyra. Let's see how that works out for you. Hopefully I can get through this without needing to heal at all. But, um, you know, you might need to heal somewhere along the line. One more rib pin actually should do it here. Oh, fine. Novin goes to sleep. Fine, I see how it is. Let's go for a fire and a regular attack. 